After I learned how to make this homemade seasoning, I never bought it in the market. I will start by adding in a container a chopped green bell pepper, a yellow bell pepper also chopped, a red bell pepper, an onion, a little parsley to taste, five cloves of garlic chopped, and I will stir everything very well with a spoon until all the ingredients are added very well, this way. Then I will season with a teaspoon of salt, half a teaspoon of black pepper, and once again, I will stir everything very well until the flavor of the spices catch well in our recipe. You can add other spices if you want. Done so, I will transfer our recipe to a container with lid so we can book more easily later. And before I forget, tell me which city you're watching so I can send you a special hug. Today's hug goes to Zali Safando from South Africa. I'm glad you're enjoying our recipes. Now I will add olive oil in the container along with our recipe until it covers everything and fills the container completely. This recipe is simply amazing, I'm sure the result of the recipe will surprise you in the end. My friends always ask me to teach how to do, so amazing that the result is. Is an amazing recipe, quick, easy, goes few ingredients and best of all, it's delicious, there's no reason for you not to do it in your home. Now I will cover and take to the fridge for 24 hours. After the time is ready our recipe, look how beautiful it was. If you want you can leave a few more days for the flavor to be more concentrated, but this part is optional. Now just serve and enjoy this delight. Has become one of my favorite recipes since the first time I tried it, now I can't stop doing it is a simply amazing and delicious recipe, make in your home and then come back here to tell me what you think. Tell me if you have any homemade seasoning recipe, I'd love to know. I hope you enjoyed this recipe. Thank you so much for watching this video so far. I'll see you in the next video, bye.